Hello everybody, I'm Mr. Kogan Tube. Today we're going to be playing Shut the Box. Hello. Shut the Box is what I'd class as a traditional pub game, although it is great for kids because there's a lot of addition involved in sort of mental maths. The game consists of a wooden box or a box of some sort. Uh, tabs numbered 1 to 9 and then two dice. The aim of the game is to get as many of these tabs down as possible with the lowest number remaining. Uh, so for instance, if you only want one remaining, you want the lowest number rather than the highest number. If the person manages to close all of these tabs, they have shut the box and are declared the winner. If the person doesn't shut the box, the remaining tabs that are up and unclosed are added up and that is a score. So in this case it would be three, it would be passed on to the next person and then if they had that, that would be five, so the person who got three would win. Hopefully you get the idea of that. So we'll run through a little demo game here. I've got the two dice, let's roll them in. we got five. So I can choose to take down the five or any combination of numbers which adds up to five. Once a number is in the closed position, it cannot be reused. Okay, we've got five on the dice. I'm going to close five. Accidentally close six there as well. Roll again. We've got a nine. I'll go for a nine. Now, I don't think everybody plays with this rule, but in the rules that I play by, if you close seven, eight, nine, the player can opt to use only one dice. Now, of course, that increases your chance of getting low numbers, so can sometimes work in the player's favour. So I'll keep going and I'll stick with the two. Okay, right. So now I'm going to have to use a combination. Because nine is gone, I'll go for an eight and a one. Now, this is where you kind of think, should I have closed that one, should I have closed that one? Got a six. We'll go four and a two. Okay, I can't close any more because that's eight and there's nothing there that adds up to eight. So we've got three, nine, and sixteen. So that's my score for the round. The box would then be passed on to the next person and they would go through the same process. The person with the lowest score would win the round. If you've enjoyed this video, then please subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Goodbye. The aim of the game is to roll these two. So I'll keep going. I'll